I'm here in a very hot and busy Sydney and I'm visiting Couriers Please. Couriers Please is one of Australia's largest e-commerce and small parcel courier organisations that are delivering over 19 million parcels every year throughout Australia. Singapore Post own Couriers Please, but they operate under a franchise model with over 700 franchisees running around in these vans all around Australia. As you can imagine, shipping over 19 million parcels across Australia, utilising the network of over 700 franchisees takes a lot of coordination. And Zebra is playing a part here in helping Couriers Please make sure that the right parcels are getting to the right places on time. Mobile computing plays a big part here at Couriers Please in making sure that all these parcels are getting to the right place nice and quickly. Now, after their old devices fell into end of life status and also a shift to a new Android operating system, here at Couriers Please they needed to find a new mobile computing device. So the device that they've chosen that these drivers will be walking away with is the Zebra TC56. come out of the heat and the noise to tell you a bit about the Zebra TC56 mobile computer. Now this mobile computer is considered to be a pocketable device. That means you can carry it around in your pocket a bit like a smartphone. It looks like a smartphone, but don't be mistaken that this device is no lightweight. It is a rugged device. It has a unibody design that protects the internal electronics and also has Gorilla Glass to make it scratch resistant and shatterproof as well. It is also dust proof and splash proof. So this is a truly rugged device here at Couriers Please. But there's more. Not only does it offer 14 hours battery life, it does have a warm swappable battery capability. So you don't need to totally shut down the device to change the battery. So it will definitely last more than one shift out here on the road. Despite its compact design, it still has a five inch screen that can be viewed in broad daylight. But there's a little bit more. There's also scanning capabilities. You can scan 1D and 2D barcode scans nice and easily. And it's quite an aggressive scanner as well. It will scan damaged or scratched barcodes or dirty barcodes quite easily. So a very, very usable device that is perfect for on the road workers. We see mobile computing technology as an enabler to our business. Um, we need to see now more and more that drivers have less time to actually be in front of any devices. So having that ability to move around while they can do their day-to-day -day operations is a real bonus. And that goes um, hand in hand with our depot staff who also need to be constantly moving. So in fact, um, mobile technology needs to be cleaner, easier to use, and especially in our environment, needs to be an, uh, a rugged device so that we can actually be a little bit more rough with it in our environment. The TC56 was a clear winner for us, especially because of the smartphone look and feel. It is also a rugged device so that's suitable for our environment where our drivers are constantly moving. And also the battery life is a big winner because these guys are on the road all the time and we can't have them stop and not um, deliver our customers' parcels. New functionality that we've seen from moving from a Windows to an Android environment is the ability to manage our security a lot better. Um, the intuitiveness of the software allows us to easily train and upskill our existing um, staff and, and drivers, so that's been a real bonus for us. Uh, the TC56 will play a huge role in our customer service improvement program. Um, we see that the ability to be able to track the parcel and give our customer service team transparency of the life cycle of the parcel as well as providing that information to our customers. So from route optimization to customer service, we'll be able to give that view um, both internally and externally and improve that customer experience in general. Mobile computing for us is an enabler for our business, um, paired with, I think, um, what Telstra or Optus are doing with their 5G network and other 
um, technologies. It's getting to into a space where mobile technology would have to be used with um, AI, machine learning, and all the components that make um, an intuitive smart network. So for us in a logistic space, we need to first and foremost provide the comfort to our customers that what we promise we will deliver and uh, mobile technology is an enabler for us to be able to start on that journey with, with our customers and consumers alike. Careers Please have moved to an Android based application. So the TC56 with its Android operating system is perfect for them. Now what that means is they've got a nice intuitive screen layout that's easy for the franchisees to adopt and use on a daily basis. And what does that all mean? Well they can be up and running and more effective with their solution quicker. It's a busy place here at Careers Please and the Zebra TC56 is helping the organisation here make sure that the right parcels are getting to the right places at the right time. So if you want to find out more about the Zebra TC56, just jump online to www.zebra.com.